Greetings and welcome to Phantom Fables, where every tale haunts the imagination. This is the tale of the haunting melody. The vinyl crackled as the needle traced its way through the grooves. The record store, nestled on the corner of Elm Street, stood in eerie silence. Its shelves were lined with forgotten treasures, each album a piece of history, gathering dust in the dim light. Tonight, on Halloween, the store was open for those brave enough to venture in. As the clock struck midnight, a chill settled in the air. The door creaked open, and a lone figure stepped inside, his breath visible in the cold. His name was Jake, a curious soul with a penchant for the arcane and the unusual. The storekeeper, an old man with eyes that held secrets, greeted him with a solemn nod. Welcome, traveler. You've come on a special night. Jake's heart raced. He had heard rumors about this place, the haunted record store that materialized only on Halloween. He was drawn here, an unwilling participant in a ghostly tale. He pursued the aisles, fingers tracing over faded album covers. The air grew heavy with a presence he couldn't quite place. Suddenly, a melody began to emanate from the speakers, soft and haunting. It was a tune he had never heard before, one that seemed to seep into his very soul. The store seemed to pulse with life, as if the music breathed it into existence. Jake turned to the old man, who now stood in the shadows, eyes fixed on him. What is this? Jake asked, his voice barely above a whisper. The music chooses its listener, the old man replied cryptically. Jake's heart pounded, but he couldn't tear himself away. The melody wrapped around him, its tendrils sinking deep. He closed his eyes, losing himself in the haunting notes. As the song reached its climax, a presence materialized before him, a figure cloaked in shadows, with hollow eyes that bore into Jake's soul. A voice, a mere whisper, echoed in his mind. Listen, mortal, for this is my requiem. The room spun, and Jake felt himself pulled into a vortex of sound and darkness. He glimpsed fragments of lives, of lost souls bound to the music, their faces contorted in eternal anguish. Suddenly, he was back in the store, the melody fading into the stillness. His legs gave way, and he crumpled to the floor, gasping for breath. The old man approached him, his gaze filled with pity. You've heard the song of the lost. It marks you now. You carry it with you, always. With trembling hands, Jake stumbled to his feet and fled from the store, the haunting melody still echoing in his ears. He knew he would never forget that night, nor the spectral presence that had claimed a piece of him. Years passed, but the music never left him. It whispered in the shadows, a constant reminder of that fateful Halloween night. Jake lived his days haunted by the Requiem, a prisoner of a song that belonged to the lost. And on each Halloween, as the clock struck midnight, the record store on Elm Street would open its doors, waiting for another curious soul to be ensnared by the haunting melody. If you like this tale and want more please like this video and subscribe to this channel for more haunted tales. Until next time, let your imagination haunt you.